If you just finished watching the basic roofs video, then you should have a building with two rooms, a door, and a roof. If not, you should review the previous video or download the TCW file from the URL found in this video's description. In this video, we will show how to create a gable roof by editing an existing roof and modifying the walls. Some of the tools shown in this video are only available in the professional and platinum editions of TurboCAD. So if you are using TurboCAD Deluxe, I am afraid you are limited to basic roofs. Let's start by moving one of the walls, but first hit F3 to bring up the design director and turn off the text and roof layers. Now switch to a top view. Let's use the keyboard shortcut Alt plus up arrow. Let's move the top wall 3.5 feet. Select the top wall, then tab into the delta Y field in the inspector bar and type in 3 feet dash 6 inches. Looks like we will need to edit the floor slabs as well. Go ahead and select the slab in the larger room, then grab the middle node on the top of the slab and snap it to the wall. Repeat this process for the bathroom slab. Alright, now back to the roof. Turn the roof layer back on. Notice we will need to edit the roof a little bit to fit the walls under it. Select the roof with the edit tool and move each of the top nodes snapping them to the outside corner of the wall's intersection. Now select the roof, then double click to open properties. Click on roof, then change the rise to 8 and hit OK. This will give the roof a steeper pitch. Next we need to edit the slope angle of two sides of the roof. Select Edit Slope Angle from the Architectural Toolbar or Menu. Pick the left side of the roof and change the slope angle to 90 and hit Enter. Repeat this on the right side of the roof. Let's switch to an isometric view and examine our model. Notice how some sections of the roof have disappeared? We will need to edit the wall to fill in these gaps. With the Roof Wall Modify tool selected, choose the section of the wall you want to edit followed by the roof you want to fit the wall into. Now let's examine the model in draft render mode. Notice how modifying the wall fills in the gaps left by editing the roof? Next we will go over how to add additional roof modifiers, but for now go ahead and save this drawing as Gable Roof. 